A bid to boost our security, Ugbora community have inaugurated the Ugbora industry vigilante to help clamp down on crime and other social vices that might hamper peace in the community. The young and vibrant man and a lady went under four intense weeks of vigorous training by the Nigerian police force and are set to commence operations immediately. In an official inauguration ceremony which was attended by the workaholic Ugbora president Dr. Nelson Ukoko aka Jenepo and his members of ESCO, the young and energetic men underwent an exhibition exercise before being presented to the community for inauguration with Mr. Blessing Ogoro announced as commandant and Mr. Gift Agbone to deputize. Let's stick to my word and carry out my instruction. Right turn! This event is coming after some developmental works done by the Jenekpo led administration as road projects are being carried out in the community with electricity fully restored, a fate that has been suffered by the community dwellers for many years. Leaders of various quarters in Ugbore expressed delight at the inauguration of the vigilante and urged them to carry out their task diligently and see it as an opportunity to serve their community. My name is Steve Yonomukoro, the most senior leaders of the community. So I'm very happy for what uh, President and the DPO and the, so, and the CO1, what they did today. Yeah, this is what we are even playing for, for ever since, because we have been liking of many things. Here about 14 years ago, we um, be, we had I mean, guided the community, I wish we wasted, we waste our money from here and there all the time. And still yet, we are still having many problems. So when this president, uh, uh, Jalebo, uh, Lexin Ukoko, is a very nice president, is a good president, and he come to the community to exhort this community to make sure that this community blows up. So it makes us so very happy. According to what he has said, and he really he is working to what always what he said. So it makes the community so very happy. Up to Today, when they restore the vigilante of Ugbore community, and I pray to God Almighty, God, God will not give them a good mind to walk all over what is the community. My name is Mr. Harry J. Ekwajemi, the water leader, Olori of Dumugbaku. At the same time, the chairman of Nigeria Hunters Association. I'm so happy that vigilante were inaugurated in Ugbore today. And, uh, my advice to them to keep peace in the border. At the same time, they work hand in hand with the Nigeria hunters. And this is what has been happening. That is, this has not be happened before, so I congratulate Mr. Yeah. President Igeleko to store the vigilante in the border community today. At the same time, my greeting goes to the executive committee, the leaders, at the same time, the DPO, even as far as the commissioner of police, of Nigeria police that they restore vigilante here in Ugbore today. Ugbore President Dr. Nelson Ukoko told Rero TV why it is important to have a vigilante group in the community and render advice to them. President, sir, uh, we've seen you uh, bring light to Ogbore. Uh, there's a road uh, construction ongoing, but today you've inaugurated the vigilante. What, what, what actually prompted you to uh, carry out this move, sir? Well, thank you very much, uh, Rural TV. Very good brand. Um, first of all, before I came, I have a mantra uh, in my heart that our system can work. So when I came on board, I picked up that uh, mantra. So if you go to our uh, letter paper, you see our system can work. Yes, good things can happen in Africa to a black man, black race, to a community. So I look at the community, I have to start from A to Z. Infrastructure, security. I've uh, restored the lights within a couple of months now. 
I have planned the roads to the community, the community roads, adjoining roads, and we have a major road project going on from uh, uh, Boraya Umulu Road to Amukwe that will link us to Amukwe Town. That's uh, that's uh, good development. However, doing all this without security is like wasting time. So I have to um, select um, these the boys to um, you know let them apply for the like they applied, and we handed them to the Nigerian police because we are not qualified to train them. And uh, they were really trained by the DPO of Saple. It's under the responsibility of DPO of Saple. He screened them, and they went for intense training of uh, four weeks. Now here they are today now the successful ones and we are inaugurating them not just with MTN, we are inaugurating them with a, a vehicle which will soon uh, unveil to them with um, a, a motorbike to patrol the community because we are a river right community, we have other facilities, we have a boat or any community that we are putting in place that will refurbish, we will patrol everywhere. You know the security situation in our country today. Security is local, so we are going to make sure we take off our local security and help the government out. So my main reason of doing all this is to make a, a good structure, a good um, 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 government for Bora, that everything will be in place without um, having excuses that there's no money. Yes, there's no money, but the little we have, we get. And when you do this, government will, will, will beam the light on Bora very soon. And to my what we are doing and support us. This uh, young men are inaugurated. So what will be your word of uh, advice and encouragement uh, in terms of them carrying out their, their duties? Uh, my word of advice for them is uh, the training they've gone through. No knowledge is lost. It's a very, a very good knowledge. I um, advise them to use it properly. They should shun crime completely and they should not also not use this uh, training and this uh, little um, uh, power they have now to oppress anybody. If they do, we don't have them to the, um, to the law enforcement. That's it. They should use it to empower themselves. And uh, I heard the state governor is planning to make a, a, a vigilante a community policing. They will benefit from that. So we have a good governor. So those are the things. They should use it properly. It's a good platform. And uh, the training they've gone through alone is uh, a kind of discipline that we uh, prepare them to greater heights. Okay, sir. Are, are there other uh, projects uh, in the pipeline for the people of Ugbore under the Genekole administration? Every, every, every. There's your temptation again. We have a lot. Like I said, I, I, I do things before I talk. Call it, um, um, call it, uh, why you call it um, uh, superstition? I don't like to say what I will do. I will do it before I unveil. That's me. There's a lot of things, but I won't say nothing. In Ogbora, this is Railroad TV. And my name is Akbor Henry Akbos. Thank you for watching.